This is capacitor. It is one of the most common passive components in the electronics field. A capacitor is a two-terminal device. It can store energy as an electric charge. It consists of two electrical conductors that are separated by a distance. The space between the conductors may be a vacuum or a dielectric, an insulating material. We know the capacitor's ability to store charges as its capacitance. Capacitors function a lot like rechargeable batteries. A capacitor and a battery differ in how they store energy. Unlike batteries, a capacitor's ability to store energy doesn't come from chemical reactions. It comes from its design, which holds negative and positive charges apart. Capacitance has its own standard unit. The basic unit of capacitance is a farad, but a farad is a large unit for practical tasks, so capacitance is usually measured in subunits of farads. These are microfarads or picofarads. But how are capacitors classified? We classify capacitors as 1. Fixed capacitors 2. Variable capacitors 3. Trimmer capacitors We classify the capacitors into two types according to polarization, polarized and unpolarized. 1. A polarized capacitor is an important electronic part. It is often called an electrolytic capacitor. Engineers use these capacitors to achieve high capacitive density. 2. Unpolarized capacitors are preferred over polarized ones. They don't get destroyed by reverse voltage, so you can use them in pure AC circuits. They also find applications in DC circuits, as they don't have positive or negative ends. The frequency of the unpolarized capacitor is high, and the leakage current is low. After understanding the classification of capacitors, let's learn about their types. So let us now know various types of capacitors. We categorize capacitors into two mechanical groups. Fixed capacitors have a fixed capacitance and a variable one. Below is a brief description of various capacitor types and their properties. 1. Ceramic capacitors. 2. Film capacitors. 3. Power film capacitors. 4. Electrolytic capacitors. So I hope you found this video helpful. If you do, please like, share and follow. Also comment on what video to make next, so have a wonderful day. Peace out.